Hello, have you ever seen the photo of the surface of the moon? It's full of craters. To understand how they are formed, let's make an imaginary trip to the moon's surface. We need some sand or a flower wood too to be used as a surface of the moon. We put it in a container and make it and to make it more real, we can find some more sand of different color or tinted flower and then we put a thin layer over the layer we have already formed. Then we collect some stones. Any stone would do because in the universe all the meteoroids are of different shapes and sizes. Now let's imagine that we are in space and many stones or meteoroids are flying from all directions. We throw the stones and we see that it leaves a print on the surface. This print is what astronomers call craters. We can also see that from these craters some energy rays come out. Both these energy rays and the shape of craters give astronomers information about the meteoroid. In space these objects come from all directions. So let's continue throwing the stones from all angles. Probably you have heard the expression shooting stars. It means that when a meteoroid enters the Earth's atmosphere, get burned by the atmosphere and gives the impression that the star is falling from the sky. On the moon, since there is no atmosphere, so all the meteoroids reach the surface of the moon forming many craters. Now, let's start removing the stones from our moon. Do you think it does or it doesn't look like the surface of the moon?